Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum. My name is Asan and today we are going to display custom order status in bulk action list drop down in admin order list page in WooCommerce WordPress. Before starting work, it's my request. Please subscribe my channel. Thank you. Now back to our work. We are using this plugin WP code insert adder and footer. So you will install this plugin and activate it because we are using custom code to create custom order status in WooCommerce WordPress. Now go to edit code. Now you see I already added code and code is active. By using this code, we are created ship status. Now you see custom order status ship. Now go to order page. Now you see bulk action drop down. You don't see any custom order status here. But open any order and scroll down. You see status processing. Click on it and then scroll down. You see shipped. So this is custom order status. So click on it and then click on update. Now scroll down. You see order updated. And then order notes. You see order status change from processing to shipped. Now back to order section. So click on it. Now scroll down. You see order status change here. But in drop down, we don't see our custom order status. So we are going to add it. Now back to edit code. And you will find this code in video description or in comment section. Now you see we created order status shipped using this code. Now you see. Now we are going to extend this code to display custom order status in drop down. Now paste code. And you will find all code in video description or in comment section. Now you see this code adding custom status to admin order list bulk action drop down. Now you see we added mark processing and then this is our order status shift. Now text change status to shift. Now click on update. Now snippet updated. So we are extending the previous code. But you will find all code in video description or in comment section. So we added this code now. Now go to order page. Now you see order status ship. Now select change to processing again and then click on apply. Now scroll down you see one order status change. Now you see order status processing and page is refreshed also. Now you see bulk action drop down. Now select and then you see change status to shift. Now select order. So this is bulk action. So you can select multiple order according to your requirement to change order status. Now select. Now select change status to shift. And then click on apply. Now you see our order status is changed from processing to shift by using bulk action. Now you see. Now back to edit code. Previously, we are using this code. This code created custom order status in ordered page, but not in drop down list. So we extended this code and adding this code to add custom order status in drop down list. Now you see change status to shift and you will find all code in video description or in comment section. So I hope you like this video. Please like, comment, share, subscribe. Thank you for watching.